this is the kind of application I wouldn't mind paying $20 for or even more $25, $30 even because this is literally the best emulation app you are going to find for the for HP calculators okay I already installed it so this is unfortunately not available for iPhone users it's only for Android it works really well with pretty much any Android phone you know even tablets so I already install it if I click on open I go to settings and uh, you know you can uh, mess with uh, some of these settings here you know just play with it it's a lot of settings I don't want to make this video super long so yeah you can just uh, go over some of the I'm just gonna go over some of the features really quick so authentic calculator speed I usually like to uh, leave that checked <laughs> I, I don't know if you leave that checked then the uh, the calculator is going to be a lot slower you know but if you have it unchecked then it's going to be a lot faster okay so that's what it does for the most part and layouts uh, I usually keep uh, the uh, automatic rotation or the uh, fill screen so fill screen I don't uh, use the fill screen for this one because uh, since this is a Galaxy Z Fold 3 as you can see the display is uh, it's not your regular size phone so if you uh, select the, the fill screen the calculator is gonna look a little bit funny okay so there is that and also the volume so HP calculators they all have a uh, the beep like so as you can see if you do some you, see, you hear this beep they all have this a lot of them have that you know a lot of a lot of them have that so you can uh, adjust the sound for that and the haptic feedback the vibration you can adjust that as well i prefer to set mine to three or five because i don't like like a really strong vibration when i'm using the calculator and uh the kml color so that's just the background it's gonna uh, use a uh, like a uh, a gray color for the background instead of black. So yeah, that is that. And uh, yeah, some of these stuff are you know for I guess advanced users. I don't really mess with none of those stuff. You know, I just like to keep everything simple. So if we go back here and we click on new, then you have all these calculators to choose from. You know, some of them are you know look kind of funny. But these are the main ones, you know, we are I always I use the the 40G, I mean 40GS, I don't use the 40G, I use the 40GS, uh, the 49G, 49G plus and 50G. 50G is the most loved, it's the most loved one, I guess. That's, uh, I think that's the most popular HP calculator, I think. Okay, so you have a different uh, resolution for uh, uh, the same calculators. So you see. It says uh, Erix Real 49G Plus. Don't worry about the Erix. That's just, uh, I guess, that's just the name they decided to give it. Okay, so it's just gonna be a 40 40G Plus. When it says Large Cropped, then uh, that's just gonna show a uh, display and the keypad. But if you select Full, Large Full, for instance, it's gonna show you like uh, the whole calculator, as you can see here. So this is, uh, it's gonna ask you to save. You know, if you plan on reusing it, you uh, reusing it, you can always save it. You can just uh, give it a, any name, 50G. Okay, save it. And uh, no. So it is pretty much one, uh, one to one. This is anything you can do on your prime. I mean, your 50G, you can do that here as well, except it's going to be a lot faster. Okay, so we are in algebraic mode. Let's uh, graph an equation really quick x square. And uh, as you can see, <laughs> there is no delay when it comes to graphing. But if you select. Uh, authentic calculator speed then uh, it's pretty much one to one as you can see yeah it's uh, very very nice okay so we can add as many calculators as we want so let's uh, do uh, the uh, the 49G okay I'm gonna do 49G crop so this is the difference between the full and the crop so this is what the crop does it's just gonna give you the display and the keypad for the most part as you can see here so it's gonna crop it for you and uh, let's not save this I don't want to save it if we go to full then uh, you are going to see the difference large full so again full is gonna give you a uh, it's gonna show you every, everything okay so this is really nice and uh, yeah you have all the legacy ones as well just uh, give the app a try it is a free app <laughs> you know <laughs> And you don't even have to uh, you don't have to go look for the ROMs 
uh, like you, you would normally do with uh, the Graph 89 app I made a video about. Uh, so yeah, that's really nice. And uh, let's add some more. Uh, the 48 GX or SX. Not gonna save it, you know. I don't really use this one. I don't have this one because I try. I really try to use it, but I didn't like it. Okay. So thanks to this app, <laughs> this app is the reason why I purchased all these HP characters. You know, at first I decided to give uh, the 49G Plus a try because uh, I don't even know. Uh, I just wanted to give uh, RPN a chance. So. Uh, a lot of people were recommending uh, that I get uh, the 50G, but I couldn't find a 50G for a reasonable price. And uh, upon further uh, research, I came to find out that the 50G is was using the same processor and uh, software-wise, it was pretty much identical to the 49G+. Plus. So I said, oh, wow. So I can, I guess I can just uh, pick this up and see how I like it. So when I pick, pick this up, then uh, I went to the app once again, because I really, I've never really been, I, I had never been a fan of HP calculators until I, I, I installed this app. Okay, so this one froze. <laughs> I'm actually glad this happened. I don't know why this happened, but uh, yeah, I don't know what to tell you. Hmm. I guess it's because I reset the calculator. I mean, I, yeah, I messed with the window. Hmm. Yeah, so that's what it was because I, I was messing with the window. I think that's why it did that. But I don't know. Yeah, okay, but yeah, I have everything. I didn't lose anything, so that's a really good thing. So the app is uh, is really good. The app is really good. Okay, so what I was saying is that uh, I, I had not been, I had not, I had never been a big fan of HP until I started using this app. You know, even when I had the app, I wouldn't use it. You know, I would just, you know, open it up and uh, just play around with uh, the 50G. And the 50G was really hard to learn. So every time I would uh, pick this up, I would just uh, put it down <laughs> immediately. But once I got the 49G Plus and uh, then I start comparing the two, I say, oh, wow. I'm actually glad that I picked this up instead of uh, pay, uh, paying uh, 100, 150 uh, on this one so then I decided to explore more calculators you know I decided to uh, uh, try give uh, uh, give the 49g a try to see uh, what, uh, what was the difference between the two and to my surprise the 49g was identical to my 40g when it comes to the software you know even the key placements are essentially uh, the key placement is like 99 it's like 95 percent identical you know you have a uh, Certain styles are easier here, such as the catalog is the catalog has a dedicated button, but here you need to do two keystrokes to access the catalog and the equation writer. So you know, minor just those are kind of minor stuff. But when it comes to the software, they are identical. But one mistake that I did that probably wouldn't have changed my decision is that uh, I was using uh, the 49G. I wasn't using it in uh, authentic calculator speed. You know, if I had done that, then uh, I would have. <laughs> I would have prepared myself for the for how slow this is because the foreign energy is a really 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 slow <laughs> you know but if you don't have that check okay let me go back eh, i never wanted to do that oh <laughs> i don't like this and now i lost my foreign energy because i didn't save it but uh, you can always save it so this is you know this is the best emulation app you can you would find for uh, hp calculators Okay, so anyways, you already see the, you already saw the 49G. Uh, what else can we see? Okay, the 48G2, and then this is how I purchased the 48G2 as well. So <laughs> I decided to give every uh, every single calculator a try. And uh, as I was using the 48G2, I'm like, hmm, what is the difference? So well, the display seems to be slightly smaller. Then uh, I went uh, I went Google the specs and I came to find out that this one is has some really good specs as well. It doesn't it doesn't have flash memory, which is something I don't really care about because I don't really install programs or even applications on my calculator. Anyways, enough for this rent. Uh, the app is really good. It's free, and uh, yeah, just uh, give it a try because it is literally the best app. Uh, uh, even uh, the app was what well, I was I'm still surprised by the fact that the app is free you know but yeah 
I even uh, I contact I uh, I reach out to the guy who made it. It's a French guy actually. I reach out to him. You know, I wanted to. You know, uh, he has a, a website. You know, I try to reach out to him. You know, I think twice. <laughs> I don't know. I can't remember. I think I sent him an email as well. You know, just uh, you know, I told him, man, your your app is 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 really great. You know, if you ever, if you ever plan on uh, uh you know, uh, introducing like a paid version, I guess he cannot do the paid version technically because it is using a HP, HP firmware. So maybe that would be illegal. I'm not really too sure about that. But you know, I I wanted to buy him some coffee, you know, send him some paper money, but he never re responded. But uh, you know, the app is really good. Uh, give it a try. Enough for the rent.